Good morning, Luna. How are you feeling today? Nervous? I just... She should be. She looks like a big fail pip. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Don't be too hard on your sister, Tylee. We all once wore those white robes. I have the photos to prove it. I can pull them out if you want. No, no, no. That won't be necessary. Uh, I remember my first day at Ravenwood. Grandma and Grandpa were convinced I would be a pyromancer, yet here we are. Scored 97% thaumaturgy. Tyler. What about you? Were you nervous about your quiz results? Well, I knew it was between myth and ice, and since ice is obviously the best of the seven schools, it only makes sense for me to be a thaumaturge. <laughs> and a boy. I don't even care what school of magic I get. I just want to get it over with so you guys will stop asking me about it. Now, Luna, I'm sure you will be an excellent wizard no matter your school. Uh, if only your mother were here to see this day finally happen. <sighs> yeah. I wish she was too. Hey mom. I don't know if you can hear me up there. Today's my first day at Ravenwood. I know you'd be proud if you could see me. Everyone is so eager to know what school I'll end up being. I think Tyler and Dad are hoping I'll be ice like them. I don't really care what the results are. But I am a little nervous. You know how hard it is for me to adjust to new things. I guess I get that from you. Anyway, I wish you were here with me. Wish me luck. One ticket to Ravenwood, please. One ticket, coming right up. <sighs> Off we go. Master's assistant. Everyone in my family is a death wizard, so I already know that's what I'll be. Please be Storm. Please be Storm. Are you nervous too? Oh, me? Um, maybe just a little. Alrighty, everyone, listen up. Welcome to your first day here at Ravenwood School of Magical Arts. I am Erica Haven, your student wizard president, hand chosen by Ambrose himself, and I will be in charge of your school quizzes. Remember, each school is unique in its own way. Be proud of your results and have fun with the magical spells that each school has to offer. <laughs> oh, and when you have completed your quiz, you can head on over to your dorm room where you'll be met with your new uniform in accordance with your school colors. Any questions? No? Okay. This is it. No turning back now. Which best describes you? Well... I'm not that creative. I'm not athletic. I definitely could benefit from studying harder. My favorite animal? Owl isn't even on here. I just don't get it. None of these make sense. Is this some sort of prank? How is everyone already finished? Hey, uh, uh, uh... Luna. It, it's Luna. Right, so is there, like, a problem with your quiz or something? Because I noticed it's taking you a really long time to complete it, and I kind of have a tour I'm supposed to be guiding, and... Um, sorry, here. Ah, thanks. Let me just go analyze your results real quick, and... Huh. Huh? Oh, nothing. No, this can't be right. Surely something is wrong. This is obviously just a fluke. I've helped dozens of students, and I've never seen this before. What is it? Uh, just... Hold on. <laughs> Master, I know you told me to only use the crystal ball to contact you in case of emergencies, but this is a really big emergency. It says inconclusive. Yes, I'm sure. Her name is Lotta or something like that. Mustn't tell anyone. Uh huh. Keep her in white for now. But are you sure? I will have to deal with this myself. Okay. Thanks, Headmaster. So, Lana, it appears that you're just going to have to wear your white starter robe for now. I know it may be a bit of a disappointment, it's but- Luna. What? Well, you said Lana, but it's Luna. Right, Luna. 
I'm usually really good with names, but, you know, with meeting so many new wizards today and being the headmaster's assistant, of course, there's lots on my brain. Anyway, I have a tour to give and you won't want to miss out on it. Out this way! Why is she still in white? Did she forget to take a quiz or something? Ew, look at that girl over there. <laughs> what a loser. Hey, how'd your test go? Did you... struggle to answer the questions at all? Nope, not at all. That'd be silly. It's not a real test. Wait, did you? Okay, I know this sounds weird, but it felt like I was trying to read Grizzleheim runes. I admit that I didn't really go into this expecting a specific school, but I didn't resonate with any of them. Yikes, I scored 100% in life, but I already knew I would. All the girls in my family are theurgists, and the boys are sorcerers. It's been that way ever since my great-great-great-grandparents. Well, except for my great-uncle. He was fire, but we don't talk about him, because we're pretty sure my great-grandma may have had the hots for a handsome pyromancer back in the day. <sighs> Poor great-grandpa. Uh, yeah. Poor guy. I'm Cassie, by the way. Cassie Day. Well, Cassandra is my real name. But no one calls me that, aside from my mom when she's angry. <laughs> I'm Luna. Well, Luna, I wouldn't worry too much about your quiz results or lack thereof. I'm sure you'll get it all figured out soon. Yoo-hoo, everyone! Welcome to campus! I am Erica, your student wizard president and headmaster's assistant, and it is an absolute pleasure to have the honor to share this magical place with all of my fellow students. You can think of me as your big sister here. I've been here at Ravenwood High for the past two years, and I know pretty much everything there is to know. I hate to brag, but I'm almost level 15 and have helped everybody out here. I've even trained into a couple other schools. I know Snow Serpent, Blood Backfire Elf, Infection, and- We get it. You're a teacher's pet. <laughs> I worked hard for my position! <sighs> anyway, so if you ever have any questions or concerns, I am always here to help. Now let's get on with the tour. It's about time. <laughs> so, over here is the Storm School. Me and Halston are on a first name basis, but you guys will refer to him as Professor Bailstrom. Just be careful not to walk too close to Torrance unless you have an umbrella. I made that mistake way too many times as a new wizard. <laughs> and over here is the Fire School. Well, well. Look who failed her first test. <laughs> As if you didn't already stick out like a sore thumb. Now you really have all eyes on you. And not in a good way. Leave her alone, Sarah. She didn't fail it. She's just... She's just what? Inconclusive? <laughs> I'd be so embarrassed if I were you. Oh, first day at Ravenwood, and you're already behind. What a shame. You know everyone here is talking about you, right? <laughs> Totally. <laughs> Couldn't be me. Well, now we're all going to be behind because someone is holding us back from our tour. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Come on, guys. Later. Failure. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <gasps> I can't believe her. We have to go straight to Ambrose. No, he no, we don't. I don't want to draw even more attention to myself than I already have. We can't just let Sarah get away with that. When she sees that she can bully you, she will turn everyone here against you. How do you even know her? Well, my mom owns that hat shop in the shopping district, and I help with the sewing repairs most of the time. I know pretty much everyone in the city, the circumference of their head, what their shampoo smells like, and... Oh, ignore that last part. Uh, anyway, Sarah is not 
So when you want to let Runny over, I knew she'd be put in the school storm. I just knew it. Well, she sure did a lot of damage to my glasses, so I guess it's fitting. It's okay, really. Let's just go. I don't want us to get in trouble. Luna, I've been wondering when you would get home. Tell me all about your first day. Grandma and Grandpa have been certain you would come home a conjurer, but I just have to see for myself. Oh no, no, no. He's gonna see. He's gonna know. Oh, Luna, you must have forgotten to change into your school uniform. Do you need to ride back to campus to pick it up? No, Dad. Uh... D uh did, did they forget to give you your new uniform? That doesn't sound like Ravenwood. No, they didn't forget. They just... couldn't. They couldn't? What, 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 did I just run out of your size or something? No, I didn't get my school results. I overheard the student wizard president talking to the headmaster today. She said that I'm inconclusive. Inconclusive? <laughs> I've never heard of that before. Are you sure that's what you heard? That's what I heard. I'm positive. Surely it was a mistake on their part. I want you to talk to the headmaster first thing tomorrow morning. Do you understand? And... But wait a sec, where are your glasses? Oh, I just decided I wanted to try my contacts out. Um, and Dad, don't tell the rest of the family about this, okay? Please just wait until I get it sorted out. Okay, sweetie. <laughs> you know, if there's ever something you need to tell me, I am here for you. I know, Dad. Thanks. <sighs> this was not how I expected my day to go. Yeah, there's no fixing these. At least I've got backup. I never loved wearing these. There was always a sense of comfort in hiding behind my glasses frames. But I guess now I don't have a choice. Jeez. I forgot how weird these felt. What? Luna, you okay? What the heck? Uh, yeah, Dad. I'm fine. I, uh, I just broke a nail. I don't understand. To be continued. <laughs>